Go. We are recording. We are go. Welcome back, friends. It's been another week. A whole week. Oh my gosh. Man, weeks are flying by, aren't they? We are here to try blade and bow this time. Because we had it in the cabinet. Yes, we didn't have to buy it again. Blade and bow is actually a pretty interesting uh, whiskey. We've been mixing it with copious amounts of diamond. <laughs> Uh, but it's actually a pretty interesting whiskey, so you'll notice on the fucking thing here, there is a little key hanging. And all these keys are numbered. And this is a three. If you get all five keys, you can go down to the place where they actually make this shit, and you can get yourself a free engraved glass. Now, the bottle of whiskey costs like 60 bucks. So, if you spend $60 five times, yeah, they better make me a fucking glass with my fucking... Yeah, with my, my, they you should! <laughs> make your own engraved glass. I, honestly, at that price, um, you could probably get a lot of glasses for a lot cheaper. But you're here, we all know what our hobbies are, okay? Yes, we all love this! <laughs> this is our favorite Isn't thing. this great? Now, uh, let's see what the experts have to say about Blade and Bow. We haven't seen <laughs> this. Yeah! Don't listen to that name! That's definitely not recognizable. Hmm. Fuck Blade and Bow. God, holy shit. How often can we cuss before we get, like, uh, demonetized? I don't know, is that fence? Are we monetized? Oh, we're not monetized, we're doing this for money. Yeah, I don't know, I mean, fair point. <laughs> what else are we doing? <laughs> We've been cussing since episode one. Well, uh, let's keep it fucking going then. We'll make a Patreon. Keep it wow. <laughs> Give us fucking money. To be great, why don't you just snip the whiskey, sir? <laughs> hold on, hold on. This one I want to do, this one a little different. What is that? I want us to smell the whiskey and see if we can predict what the experts will say about the whiskey. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, I know. Just see what the, what the average man has. Alright, let's get our couple snips here, alright? Oh, yeah. Oh, Chris. It's a bit stronger than uh, the other one, Red Breast. Red yeah, Breast. I think this is an Octite 91. I think this is mid grade. Woo! Yeah, that's it could be 93. Fuck me, man. It could be 93. Holy shit. Okay, so no idea what proof that is, but you can definitely smell the alcohol on it. I um, am not uh, looking forward to throwing this. Right, um, okay, what notes do you have? What notes do you detect? Despair? Is that uh, a note? Like, just, you know? No, that's legit. I can't smell anything. Like, in, in the comments, tell us how to smell these stupid whiskeys. I assume you use your nose, yes? Yeah, uh, right. Wait, other people, they're using their nose. What it, nose do they have? It it's not different than ours. Bad. It, it just smells like straight it alcohol. Does, it does smell bad. Um, it, sounds, it smells like this is going to burn the fuck out of my mouth when I throw it into my mouth. Let's see. Um, that's really what it smells like. Okay. Uh, right, we got it. Doesn't it? What else are you getting? Okay, hold on. Let's okay. Try to breathe it. Just try to breathe a full fucking lung of that shit in, and then maybe it'll desensitize us to the whiskey. <laughs> no, I should. I should. I should go back to smoking. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> I think okay, that'd be healthier for me. On the nose, I legitimately smell nothing. Let's I smell alcohol. alcohol. Let's this move on. Special edition whiskey from Stitzel. Yeah. Remember we yeah, had Stitzel. Twenty-two year old blade, which I don't have. My chaser. But there's also citrus oh. in this one, mm -hmm. kind of fruit smells. Okay, citrus and fruit smells. Oh, so. that is just a friendly bourbon. Mm -hmm. Mine's very floral. Very floral. Okay. Almost carnation floral. Yeah, I like mm -hmm. that. Overwhelming. Oh, well, how about you, man? Full bouquet. I'm assuming you mean by citrus. It's floral, it's citrus. Citrus. Getting the tiniest hint of mint. Yeah. Okay, there's a hint of mint in there. Yeah. We're not picking that fun. <laughs> Oh, oh, there's the mint. Oh, yeah, the oh. Mint. he had to find oh, it a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's the yeah, fucking mint. Search for the mint. Oh, it's a meat tea lad. All right, guys, so we're looking for uh, a friendly. It's a friendly bourbon. It's very floral, lots of flour, mint, and even. only a hint of mint. Oh, it's just, uh, it's, it's a delicate. Our, our unsophisticated yeah. pals will not pick up that. We can't we do more to this. Fucking guy! Chasing the daisies right, right. and the flowers, alright? But no mint. Okay, so. Alright, so. What did you. On the uh, on, on the nose, do you Sorry. smell anything? I, I smell like 180 fucking proof, okay? Right. Like, I'm, I'm just getting myself psyched up for this shit. Down the hatch! Woo! <laughs> mm. Oh, there's the mint! Woo! That 
mint is not. Oh, that burns. Okay, floral. So I think, I think what they described as fruity and floral. You burn that fucking flower. <laughs> oh man. Uh, <laughs> so what these guys mean when they describe like floral and bright, and they what they really mean is burny and awful. Horrible. That's terrible. That's an awful drink. And fuck. Well, I, don't, I have something here. That might make it a little bit better. Oh shit! We haven't even we you haven't even got to the mint palette yet. Has it already been disgraced that far? Yes. Oh shit! <laughs> oh, let's uh, let, hold on. Let's uh, let's do a little bit more. Let's just uh, come on. We'll just give it a shot. Let's see what else they have to say. I'm gonna chase him some pizza. <laughs> oh, they're double dipping. Let's go for more. Okay, so I'm gonna tell you something about this. The way they make this is very unique. Uh, it's done in several scotches. It's not often done in whiskey and bourbons, okay? And, I, and it's super cool. It's uh, common in wine. It's called Solero Cassie. Mm -hmm. now, Solero Cassie. It's a Barcelona agent. This is a fancy way of saying uh, we stretch the dollar because fuck you. Oh, That's like, all they're really saying. We could have told you that. Like that. Whiskey manufacturers yeah. are just taking the uh, the oldest barrels and mixing them with the youngest barrels, essentially, and then. Charging you sixty dollars a bottle. Can we mix it with Diet Mountain Dew? It's bullshit, <laughs> and you're paying for it. But hey, fuck it. You know, yeah, I'm sure it makes a difference, right? All right. Well, you know, you kind of jumped the gun, but well, look, let's get one last adult. Uh, un. You want to taste it twice? All right. Ooh, that's fun. All right. You Ooh. taste that freaking diesel Ooh, gas? Ooh, it's bright. It's bright. It's flowery, my friend. What do you not taste? Oh shit. How do you how do you not oh, taste shit. it, right? I'll tell you what. Oh that's, there's the mint. I see it. It's minty. Oh you just it. have to look past the fire and the flames and then the <laughs> the, the, the brimstone, the gnashing of teeth. Alright, this is the worst whiskey we've had. Do you think so? This is the bad one? Alright, so blame What do you think? What do you think? Yes. Right, where are you putting it? You yes. putting about four roses? Or um, no, I think four roses is Why else I thought four roses was better? I think four roses is better. Um, yeah, Four Roses better than Blaine Bow. Yep, 100%. Uh, I totally agree. Our scale is basically all on burn, so <laughs> this one burns less than Four Roses. Well, okay, so burn is kind of, uh, I feel like burn Red is... Red Breast 12 was way less than this. Burn, I think, is almost uh, like associated with taste, though, because if I can't get past the burn, I can't taste anything. Mostly right. bitter. It's mostly bitter notes. Yeah, do yeah, you need some more? You could say like there's, there's, you could lie you and say there's some more oaky notes and that there's leather. Oh yes, mm, I taste the leather shoe. Yeah, I think you're on fire right now. Anyway, ooh, we might be able to. Yeah, hold on, what proof is this? It's proof enough. Actually, I think it's less than the four roses. Oh shit, you're right. So this is less proof. This is less alcohol than four roses, but it still burns. What's just that? Ninety one proof, buddy. So my eyes kind of suck. Uh, yeah, 91 proof, 45.5% alcohol, uh, Four Roses was 100 proof, so, not doing very good. Yeah, and yet it I tastes mean, like it's such a higher proof. I think the, I think what everyone is looking for is the fact that, uh, we're looking for alcohol with the least amount of burn. That's all we're looking for in a good Well, whiskey. if you can get alcohol with the least amount of burn, you can actually get some taste on it. Mm -hmm. You can actually mm -hmm. get some taste on it. And, and you don't have to... Uh, Dude, Chase mix it with, it's pretty good. With delicious Diamond Mountain Dew, not sponsored. Hey, do uh, the do. We will take sponsors, though. Though they ought to sponsor us. They ought to sponsor us. You're good. Not, us. We're not begging for it. Just please. <laughs> Just please. <laughs> we're so <laughs> poor. <laughs> <laughs> Just, come on. Mm, All right. Diet fucking new. Do the do. Diet do, my friend. Alright. Tune in next week for another one. Uh, thanks a bunch, guys. Yeah, thanks a bundle. That right. Was, that was fantastic. Bad. That was, what do you think? That would suck. That really was dog shit, wasn't it? Yeah, that was bad. Alright. Um, anyway. Uh, fucking...